this is something that I, I used to do. And I'd like to reimplement. I had certain quotes and certain notes, like from therapy, like written next to my bed. So when I would wake up in the morning, instead of waking up to my own anxiety or waking up to my own shitty narrative, like I would have a reminder that slapped me right in the face, being like, "No, no, no, no. you're going to think shitty. You're going to have this. Let's let's get ahead of this. Yeah. yeah, that's not going to serve you." So it doesn't have to be like some well, super you know, lovey dovey note, but just something that that daily stoic book helps me. I yeah, like that a but, lot. Uh, but aren't you? But I guess I would struggle with this idea of like, aren't you smart enough to know that that's a trick? Aren't you smart enough to know that like you it's put that a, there? It's not a trick. It's I a I, w- I would go. Hey, I put that there. Uh-huh. So to remind if yourself, I know that I'm a fucking idiot or whatever, like, and I put a note there that says, "Hey, you're not a fucking idiot." I'm like, yeah, but like. But you're, sure. ma- you're a fucking a, idiot. <laughs> this is a conscious effort you're making because you also know that you're not a fucking idiot. I mean, do I? <laughs> no, no, no. I relate to this so much. That's what I'm trying to but loop in my head. You're like, not. Yeah, that sounds like it would work. But I'll, on the other hand, I'm like, if I'm the Wiley Coyote and I'm planning the fucking bear trap there, I know there's a fucking bear trap there. I will speak. I won't say what you are, but I'll speak from my perspective and maybe this will resonate with you. Yeah. I don't trust myself. Right, right. I don't trust myself to be kind to myself. So if I'm being kind to myself or if I'm doing something positive, I'm suspicious of it. Sure. Right. So if you can then recognize that layer of it. Right. Of like, wh- why do we Why do we trust the voice for you and me specifically? The critic. Why? Yeah, why do we trust the critic uh, right. and the person that says shitty things and are dismissive of the person that says nice things. <laughs> That's, so That's what you're doing. Yeah. They're both voices in your head, but for whatever reason, you're saying, you know what? The version of me that says, well, that's a trick. You're a piece of shit. They're right. And the version of me that says, hey, you're not fat. You're a good person. They don't know what they're talking about. Right. <laughs> how do you flip that? Or how do you recognize to, to uh, that you're not your thoughts? You and your thoughts are very closely related Right. But you're not your thoughts. You're not your thoughts. Who's observing your thoughts otherwise? Like, the observer is you. Yeah. How could you know your thoughts unless there wasn't some other consciousness that is you observing them? And that's, like, the wild thing about it. 